Hello, people. All right, we're starting on falling for my boss. Um, Lexi Logan and Alma Faye have been friends since we've been best friends since high school. They are both 21 years old and renting a condo together in LA. While Alma has landed her dream job, Lexi was struggling to find hers. Huh, you are Lexi in the story. I don't know why my brightness keeps going up and down like this shit is fucking stupid. Uh, you really ready for your in are you ready for the interview? I'm so nervous. I hope this one goes my way. You'll be fine, Alex. This is the time you'll exit. You'll ace it. Uh, oh, I hope so, Al, because if I don't, I won't make the rent this month. I'll have to move back home. Come on, Lex. Have faith in yourself. This is your dream job. You'll be fine. Let's go pick an outfit that uh, will knock their socks off. Okay, let's do it. Oh, uh, well, show me that you have. Okay, give me two minutes. What do you think? Oh, look, you're gonna knock them dead. Thanks, so. I guess I'm better. Uh, I better get going. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. I need to get a grip. Come on, real. Uh, uh, come on, Lex. Keep it together. There's a secretary. I better know. I better let her know. Um, I'm here. Hello, dear. Can I help you? Hi, I'm Lexi Logan. I'm here for my interview with Mr. Marshall. Take a seat, dear. I'll let him know that you're here. Okay. Hello, Mr. Marshall. Ms. Lexi Logan is here for your 3 o'clock. Okay, I'll send her in. Ms. Logan? Mr. Marshall will see you now. That's the last door on the right. Thank you very much. Now, which door did she say? Oh, there it is. Here goes nothing. Come in. Oh my God, I just <laughs> I just died and almost going to heaven. They're standing in front of the desk, the sexiest man I've ever seen. <laughs> Hello, Mister Marshall. I'm Lexi um Lo Logan. I cannot even speak. My palms are sweaty and I feel faint. He looks up. Mm, Miss Logan, nice to meet you. Come in. Nice to meet you, Mr. Marshall. So, Miss Logan, what makes you think that we, you have what we're looking for to work here at Marshall Enterprises? Well, sir, as you can see from my resume, I have all the qualifications required for this job. With all due respect, Miss Logan, well, uh, so does everyone that has applied for the job. What makes you stand out from the rest? Oh my God, I can't even think straight. The way he says my name makes me tremble. <laughs> His dark eyes are piercing my soul. Miss Logan, I asked you what makes you stand out. Sorry, well, Mr. Marshall, I'm hardworking and I'm very driven. And if you give me a chance, I can give, anyway, I will give this job my all. This job could require a lot of travel in other countries. Would that be a problem for your boyfriend or husband? Why would he ask me such a question? I can feel the burning deep inside of me, Lexi. Jeez, Lexi, get a grip. No, sir, that would be no problem at all, as I do not have a boyfriend or a husband. Okay, that'll be all, Miss Logan. My secretary, Miss Jones, mm -hmm. will contact you. When I have made a decision, um, thanks for coming. Thank you for your time, Mr. Marshall. No boyfriend. Interesting. Um, are you here? I'm here, Lex. Um, how did the interview go? Oh, Alma, it went terrible. <laughs> There's no way I got the job. What? What What happened? Nothing. Only Mr. Rex Marshall the third is only the hottest man I've ever seen. And I turned into a mumbling mess. What is wrong with me? Oh, uh, Lex, come on. <laughs> uh, it couldn't have been that bad. Oh, it was that bad, Al. There's no way I'm getting that job. I can't even take my eyes off him. Ugh, I'm such a fool. When will you find out? He said his secretary will be in touch. What the fuck is that noise? Oh, 
I guess this is the fucking carnival truck, y'all. Um, he said his secretary will be in touch when he makes his decision. But I won't hold my breath. Don't give up just yet. Like, stranger things have happened. I'm going to bed. Uh, the sooner the day is over, the better. Okay, night Lex. Night out. Yeah, we got carnival trucks here. They don't sell ice cream on the fucking carnival trucks. They just sell fucking cotton candy and fucking popcorn and stupid shit like that. Who the fuck? Why do you have a truck of cotton candy driving it around this bitch? Anyway, I'm so tired. I need to change into my pajamas. No messages or call. What a surprise. Time for bed. Uh, who's that ringing so early on a Saturday? Hello? Yes, this is Lexi Logan. Are you serious? I'm so happy. Thank you. I'll see you on Monday morning. Goodbye. I did it, Emma. I did it. I got the job. I knew you would, Lexi. I just knew it. Where are you starting? I start Monday. Oh, I have so much to sort out. I may get new clothes. First things first, let's eat. I've made breakfast. Oh, nice. Am I so... I'm so hungry. Time to get dressed and go shopping. Are you coming? I can't today, Lexi. I have lo uh, loads of work to watch to catch up on. But enjoy yourself, okay? Bye. Talk later. Where should I go first? Sounds boring. What the fuck sounds boring? I didn't even say shit to you. Fuck. Close, I suppose. Okay, let's do this. I need something for my first day at work. What should I pick? No. That's the, I think that's the one I'm going to pick. What's the third one? Take your damn stomach out. Here we go with this one. This is perfect. Time to go. Hey, Al, do you fancy getting uh dressed up and going out to dinner to celebrate my new job? Yes, let's do it. Maybe go to a club after. Woohoo, I'm going to get ready. Me too. Be ready in an hour. I'm going to wear something hot. Love it. Emma, are you ready? Ready. This bitch like she about to go to the stroll, honey. The fucking thigh high boots on. Um, oh, this is lovely. I'm so hungry. Come on, let's get a table. The girls had a great time eating and talking for hours. Now it's time for a few drinks and a dance. This outfit is cute. She got on here. I like this little skirt here. Time for a drink. Let's get some bubbly. We we are celebrating after all. We certainly are. Oh my god. Detroit! What's wrong? Don't look now, but it's him. My new boss, Rex Marshall. Which one is he? The one with the black shirt. Well, if it isn't Mrs. Logan, time to have a little fun. Jeez, Lex, they look like uh, twins. Are they brothers? I don't know, Elma. I don't, I don't need... I, but I need to get away from there. Or from here. I have to agree with you. Lexi is super hot. What are you going to do when you work for him every day? Uh, I don't know, Apple, but my legs are feeling like jelly right now. What's wrong with me? It's normal. To, uh, it's, a, it's a normal feeling, Lex. When you fancy someone. Mm, I do not fancy him, Alma. 
I don't have time to fancy anyone. You're saying that. Uh, you're saying that your whole life flex. Oh, wait a minute. That's how you're 21 and still have never been kissed. Okay, well, whatever. I'm gonna come on. I'm going to dance. I'm gonna go dance. Okay, let's go, buggy. Come on, let's dance. This place is kicking the night. Love it. Well, I'm going for another drink and to check out the t talent. Okay, I'm gonna dance more. Wait, some more. I feel drunk. Uh. Oh God, I feel dizzy and hot. Well, Miss Logan, I hear you're joining my team. What? That voice, it's him and he's standing right here talking to me. I can't breathe, I feel sick. Why did I drink so much? Yes, Mr. Marshall, I'm looking forward to it. What are you doing? Just coming closer. Why? <laughs> because I can. Oh my God, he's, what is he doing? I'm frozen in the spot. He smells so good. I need to get out of here. What the? F okay, guys. It's been a while since I played this, but I don't remember that, girl. Oh, my God. What just happened? I'll be seeing you again. Did I just let that happen? I just had my first kiss with my new boss. Oh, no. Lexi, what is wrong? Why are you crying? I just had my first kiss, but that's great, Lexi. So why are you crying? Because it was him, Alma. It was Rex Marshall the third, my bloody boss. Why does she have to tell you so fucking name now? What is Lexi going to do? Will she accept the job? And if she does, what will happen with Mr. Marshall? Find out in the next episode of Falling for My Boss. To be continued, y'all. Hope y'all enjoy. I don't know if I'm going to post any more videos today because um, I am preparing for a funeral, you guys. Um, I don't know if I'm going to, you know, be posting any more videos, but we'll see. We will see. Hope you guys enjoyed this one, though.